Hey, anyone here? I'm eating cottage cheese. This is not ice cream. Ah. Good afternoon. I thought I'd put that in there since I didn't have my cottage cheese last night. I have to get ready for work some. Um. Wow. What a blowout on YouTube with uh, Lady A. You might as well say your name, everyone else is, and she's putting herself out there. Here's my thought, and I apologize for the sun. Thank God for the sun. Thank you, God, for the sun today. Let's be grateful for the sun, because we're getting snow maybe Wednesday. I don't have to work either. I hope we all get 10 feet, because I don't have to go to work. No, really. Um, let's stop giving her attention. She's coming into lives, okay? And it goes from somebody with good intentions to try to explain why a person does this. My angle is what she did was a crime. She's a smart girl. She doesn't need free online therapy sessions with all of us or what our opinions are. She knows exactly what she's doing because people like this are manipulative. They're very smart. They're smart, okay? Why are we giving her the attention? Why? Um, you know, this psychoanalyzing and what people should do. And that's great. That's great. People do have hearts and they do want to help. But again, this was a crime. Just as you would call 911 to let them handle it, call the cops. Call the cops. Call 911. Let them handle it. Let them analyze her. Let them evaluate her, okay? And let them take care of whatever's going on up here, okay? Because as far as I'm concerned, her coming into lives and doing this, she's seeking attention and she's getting it, okay? She's seeking attention by going into people's lives because she's writing comments and she's getting the attention, just as she was getting the attention before, okay? She has not admitted to anybody that I lied about cancer. It is a game. It is a game. It's a sick game, and I'm sorry, but I'm not qualified. No one else, I think, is qualified um, to evaluate her through social media. She needs a face-to-face. -face. She needs to be with a professional person, psychiatrist, whoever, the law, whoever, let them handle it, that's their job. But when I do a live, when I come back from work this evening, um, I will block her. I don't want the attention going into, and you know, everyone's angry and I get it, everyone's hurt. If some people wanna help, reach out. I understand that, but you're giving her the attention okay she's still hiding her face I don't see sincerity in this I don't see even her making an own video where she doesn't have to answer to people but just looking herself in the camera and saying I'm sorry I didn't have cancer uh, stop giving her the attention okay and I know my words aren't going to go very far um, because we all have a right to do what we want but think about this that attention she was seeking with donations and, and um, making up, uh, fabricating that she had multiple myeloma. And yes, cancer is a horrible thing. And how hurtful that is to families and loved ones and people who are cancer survivors. It's horrible, horrible. But she is seeking the attention that she was seeking in, other, in the way of the cancer. She's just seeking it in a different way. So, you know, we still have an issue. We still have, you know, um, like Houston, we have a problem, okay? So think about that, okay? Um, we can all yell and scream and type like, 
you admit it, did you have cancer or not, or it doesn't matter, does it matter? She didn't have cancer, I'll tell you that, I'll tell you that, okay? She does not have cancer. She does not have multiple myeloma, okay? It's her way of seeking acceptance, attention, money, and it's wrong to pull on someone's heartstrings. It's wrong for those who have lost their lives to cancer, who are battling cancer, who are um, in remission from cancer. It's wrong, and it is a crime. It's false pretense, and I'm not a cop, but, you know, it's easy to figure that out. That's basic crime 101, you know? You lie. You're taking money that you shouldn't. You're not returning it. My PayPal link has been out there since yesterday. It's been shown to her. It's under my About Me section. Granted, it's only 10 bucks, but it's the principle of this. What she did was illegal. It's restitution, okay? I haven't seen a penny yet, not a penny. So I'm just chalking it up to, yeah, I lost 10 bucks, you know? But uh, she's losing a lot more, okay? She didn't gain money. She's losing a lot more um, than we are. So that being said, just think about that, okay? She's seeking attention. She's in a live right now. She's in a live right now. And the dynamics before she came in was focused on the person giving the live. And as soon as she came in, heads turned, and it was like focus. You know, the focus was off the poor woman who's trying to give everyone, you know, what her advice would be. And people are just like coming in at Lady A, and you're giving her what she wants attention. She's not answering the questions that you're asking her. Do you notice that? She's not answering it. She's just absorbing like a sponge all this attention. All eyes are on her. Okay? It's not us, up to us. The help she needs, she's a smart girl. She's got a husband. She's got a son. Okay? Let them help her. Let them help her. You know? But can try and try and try, but to try to help someone through social media, unless you pick up the phone, call 911, they'll do what they need to do, if you have her address, and be done with it, be done with it, the drama needs to stop, this needs to be over, because she's getting what she wants, attention, all right, have a blessed day, I'll see you tonight, I'm working late, so my live will be late, um, okay, talk to you later, aloha.